hello beautiful people welcome back to my channel my name is Susie and if you see me for the first time then welcome thank you for stopping by once again to my old subscribers and today I have a collab with the most beautiful gorgeous person ever Adesua underscore gift I'm gonna leave her name on the screen and I'm gonna leave her ch the link to her channel down below we're doing a collab and this is gonna be the first of many many collabs with Adesua she's the most lovely person very beautiful very attractive she knows a lot about perfumes she is just an incredible person i'll leave her channel down below so please go check her out show her some love and today we decided to collaborate on the video we decided to choose five valentine day valentine's day fragrances and this was kind of difficult for me to just pick five perfumes but the first one I picked was one that has been my signature scent for so many years and I never get tired of this perfume. This is the perfume I used to only have about one, two or three perfumes and this was my go-to I would wear it during the winter months, summer, spring, autumn, any time of the day, morning, day, night. Mind you, some people I feel like this perfume has been getting a lot of hate on YouTube for some reason. I just do not understand who doesn't like. I mean, yeah, it's super generic. It's one that is very popular, but it's popular for a very good reason. It is just an amazing scent. I love it. I always go back to it. I always have to have it in my collection because it's just so beautiful. And the one I'm talking about is going to be La Vie et Belle from Lancome. Oh, I have the 100ml bottle and this is the original. This is a beautiful fruity floral gourmand. It has, um, I'm just gonna read the main accords from Fragrantica. The main accords are sweet, vanilla, fruity, patchouli, woody, white floral, lactonic, earthy, and iris. To me, this is just the most beautiful smelling perfume. And if you want, I mean, it is sweet. It has that, those gourmandish notes. It has, um, I think it has pear and black currant in the top note. And it has orange blossom. It has, um, what else? Let me see. In the middle notes, it has orange blossom, iris, and um, jasmine. And in the base note, it has some patchouli. It has some tonka bean. It has praline. It is just beautiful this smells so good it has a very good projection it projects like nothing else it lasts a long time this will last you a whole day i am a vivid over sprayer so i would just go ch -ch 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 -ch, but you don't have to over spray with this one if not it could be a little bit too sweet and cloying I love this perfume i love 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 this perfume and a lot of people do for good reasons, obviously, this is one that I would recommend for Valentine's Day. If you haven't tried this, you better go and try this. If you are, uh, if you love sweet perfumes and if you love some gourmands, this is just warm, sensual, sexy. I have gotten a lot of compliments wearing this perfume, and men love it. Yeah. I get a lot of compliments, especially from men wearing this perfume. So this is Lancome La Vie et Belle. And this is, I think, this is not going to be by any particular other. This is, I just gonna, I'm just going to um, talk about them randomly. So I love this one, La Vie et Belle from Lancome. Next one I want to talk about really, really surprises me. It is a dupe of a very, very popular perfume. And to me, this just puts me in a good mood every time I wear this. When I wear this to work, I get a lot of compliments. It is just airy to me. It is soft. It is beautiful. And it is Dossier's Ambre Saffron. Oh, sorry. The light is really 
Mm. Okay, there you go. So this is Dossier's Ambre Saffron. And, and this is a dupe of the famous Baccarat Rouge. To be honest, I have not smelled Baccarat Rouge, but I would love to smell that, but it costs a pretty penny. So I got this off of um, Dossier's website, and this cost me about 39 for a 50 ml bottle, 39 US dollars for a 50 ml bottle. And um, to be honest with you, I love this perfume. I really, really like it. It puts me in a good mood. It is airy. It is described as an oriental floral perfume. Let me read the, the main accords. The main accords are woody, amber, warm, spicy, fresh, spicy, aromatic, fresh, conifer, animalic. Oof, to me, this is a beautiful smelling perfume. It projects, it leaves a beautiful trail, it lasts all day, it is warm, it is sexy, it is cozy, it smells like burnt sugar. For those really cuddly moments, I think this is a beautiful one. This just, this always puts me in a good mood, to be honest with you. I wear this and I just get whiffs of it all day long and sometimes it comes and sometimes it goes it plays a little bit of a hide and seek but it is beautiful you're gonna get a lot of compliments with this one it projects but it's not in your face it projects in a very soft way but it leaves true people are gonna ask you what you're wearing i think this is a good bang for your buck this just this is just a beautiful smelling perfume and if you want to impress on a first date or on Valentine's Day, this is one that you're going to feel sexy wearing. This is one that's going to be inviting if you're with, together with your significant other or maybe you're meeting a guy for a first day or meeting a girl for a first date or even somebody you've been with, your husband, your wife because this is a unisex perfume and it, it works perfectly for men as for women this is just oh, uber uber sexy if you ask me and this is one i would recommend a hundred percent for that valentine's day and this is dossiers ambre saffron beautiful bottle it has this um this magnetic cap and you can actually pick it from the bottle which is really good the aesthetic of the bottle is really nice very minimalistic i love 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 this perfume the next one i want to talk about is a perfume that i've been loving loving to me it is sexy it is beautiful it is nice you can wear this all year round morning afternoon evening projects like a beast long lasting beautiful you're gonna love it i've actually seen a lot of mixed reviews about this perfume on youtube and i just do not understand why and this is none other than olympia from paco Rabanne. this is ah oh, i am just so taken away with this perfume in uh, in the most beautiful way ever i love this perfume i just i've fallen so much in love with this perfume and you can wear this all year round like i said day night summer winter whatever this is the one the one if you want to have one this la vie est belle recommend a hundred percent let me read the main accords it is vanilla salty white floral woody warm spicy citrus amber powdery marine balsamic this to me this is sweet it is sweet it is florally it is aquatic it is salty and you smell that vanilla it's just a beautiful beautiful blend of these notes and in the base you have this amber grease you have sandalwood this is just a beautiful blend of a perfume this is genius i love this perfume and it is sexy it is warm it is inviting oh my god 
you'd need this on Valentine's Day. If you want one perfume to wear on Valentine's Day and you're gonna feel sexy, you're gonna you're gonna feel inviting, you're gonna feel like a woman, the saltiness of it just works beautifully. It's gonna make you feel like a sexy, sexy bee. Okay, so this is Olympia by Paco Rabanne and look at the color of that juice. Isn't this gorgeous? If you need one perfume for Valentine's Day, I recommend this one a hundred percent. And yes, I know I recommend all of these perfumes I've been talking about right now, but I recommend them for a very good reason. I actually choose these five for obvious reasons. They are beautiful. And next one I have to talk about. Oh, it's a very spicy, warm, sensual gourmand. This projects moderately, but it is, I mean, you're going to feel edible. Him or she is going to want to eat you up. This to me is dark. It is a little bit mysterious. It is oh, sexy. Yes, I said sexy and this is none other than Tom Ford Noir Extreme or Extreme and this is supposed to be for guys but hey 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 this is a gourmand this has the spicy notes of caraway cardamom pink pepper and it has that kulfi or kulfi note, which is an ice cream note. And you can actually smell that ice cream. And I just, it, I don't know if it has vanilla in the base. It has, oh, it is warm. It is sexy. It is inviting. It. This is it. If you want, if you're a man or a woman and you want to be edible and you have that mysteriousness about you and you want to be a little bit, you know, dark. This is not going to be the one that's going to be for everybody. But I bet you, you're going to smell delectable. You're going to smell beautiful. You're going to smell gorgeous. And you know when you spray this and you cuddle with your significant other? Come on. Come on. Come on. If you haven't tried your nose on this one, please go ahead and try this. Tell me in the comment section below if you've tried this. And if you do, tell me how you feel about it. Leave me some love, some hearts in the comment section. And if you haven't already subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe because I make a lot of content on different topics. I do skincare, I do fashion, I do perfumes, I do whatever suits my body. I do whatever I feel like doing. Yes. So Tom Ford Noir Extreme beautiful perfume and i recommend this for a sexy date night sexy valentine's date out mm, mm, mm. you're gonna smell amazing <sighs> last but not the least is a gourmand like no other actually when i got this perfume i didn't really care about the musk in this perfume i remember when i first sprayed this Initially, I was like the muskiness kind of puts me off, but when it dries down, just like a few minutes into it, I just find I found myself wanting and wanting this perfume even more. And this perfume is described as an oriental vanilla, and it's a beautiful gourmand. And this is none other than Prada candy. Oh my God! If you have a sweet tooth, if you love sweet perfumes, then this is the one. This is beautiful. It has that caramel note. It has um, some muskiness, powderiness in the middle of the perfume. And in the dry down, it has this beautiful vanilla. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. This is so edible. Mm. Oh. <laughs> I am so in love with this perfume. This is the perfect cuddly perfume. If you want to, if you, if you, if you just want to smell like caramel, who doesn't like caramel? Mm? Your man is just gonna mm, eat you up when you, 
when he smells you like this. This is the beautiful Valentine's perfume that Netflix and chill after that restaurant date and you want to come home, put up a movie, just make some popcorn and you smell like this. <laughs> You're not gonna go five minutes into the vid um, the video or whatever movie you're watching and it's just gonna go down. It's gonna go down. This is so beautiful. This smells so girly, so nice, so warm, so sensual, so sexy. So this is my fifth recommendation. I love it. I love it. I love it. It doesn't last long though. This will last you for like four or five hours on the skin, I think. But ah, it smells so good. Eh, it smells really nice. You just be getting those whiffs and you love it. And I'm gonna cheat with this one, the last one. Okay, it's 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 let me just say it's uh an honorable mention. And this is Van Cleef and Appels. I'm not going to talk about this one too much. And this is Orchide Vanille. If you love your vanilla. And this is just vanilla with some flowers and um, chocolate and, and musk. It is nice. It is rich. It doesn't project a lot. But it's warm and cozy. A beautiful gourmand. It has some orange. You're going to mostly smell the muskiness. The orange and the chocolate. And this is my honorable mention. And it is Van Cleef and Apples. Orchidee Vanille. Mm. Mm. Love it. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you do, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Uh, Cornell, <laughs> subscribe to my channel leave some hearts down below leave anything you want to leave as this makes me grow this makes me visible on youtube and i'm looking forward to get to know each and every one of you thank you so much for watching and thank you once again at this well for collaborating with me it's been awesome getting to know you and i love you girl bye